You know, and shortly after the president spoke, we got word of another shocker. An NBA player tested positive for COVID-19 and the league suspended the season. Mike, this is huge. It really is, and it means that the NBA won't be playing basketball for the foreseeable future. How long that means is frankly anyone's guess, but this latest development started tonight in Oklahoma City. Moments before the tip, the Oklahoma City Thunder team doctor ran out on the floor and talked with officials. The teams all left the floor, and after a delay, they announced the game had been postponed. In the hour that followed, it was reported that Utah Jazz center Rudy Gobert had tested positive for COVID-19. Shortly thereafter, the league announced that the NBA season was suspended until further notice. Meanwhile, Chris, it came down just about 45 minutes ago that the NHL is not suspending play, at least as of right now. They say they're continuing to consult with medical experts and they're in a wait and see mode right now. And when it comes to the NBA, does this mean we're packing up, we'll see you guys in October? Right, no, this, this is a suspension, not a cancellation. So the amount of time that the season is suspended is certainly up in the air. We don't know if it's gonna be two weeks, we don't know if it's gonna be longer than that. But the plan anyway, as of right now, is to resume play at some point. It's up to the NBA when that happens though. All right, thanks Mike.